Well, a new year, new laws. Several new laws will take effect at the start of 2019, from an increase in minimum wage to a longer recess for elementary school students. We're breaking down the changes you need to know about. Team 12's Monica Garcia has the details. As we say goodbye to 2018, there are some new laws that could affect everything from your wallet to your children. Starting January 1st, the hourly minimum wage in the state will increase 50 cents to $11 per hour. I think it's absolutely great. Teenager Alexis White says she's excited about the boost as she looks forward to joining the workforce for the first time. It helps you make a decent amount of money quickly and you know especially if you're saving it for college or you know your first car. But Kareem Bobby isn't as thrilled. Her family runs a restaurant and she's worried the increase will cause a ripple effect that could hurt business. There are some pretty intense side effects to that. There are a lot of people who are coming in the door who have little to no experience that we're now going to have to pay the same age that we were paying people who initially came in with experience. So now the people with the experience need to get paid more and so on and so forth. Speaking of paying more, another law going into effect in January is a new fee for drivers. All Arizona car and truck owners will pay a $32 public safety fee when they renew their vehicle registration. I think that's okay as long as we get to see the results of it and the improvements of our roads and, and our infrastructure. Judging by the social media reaction, it's taken a lot of people by surprise. Things go up and you know, there are a lot of states where it's actually even more expensive. Next up, more play. Earlier this year, Governor Doug Ducey signed into legislation mandating public schools in the state provide at least two recess periods per day for students kindergarten through fifth grade. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. That, that would be cool. amazing. Yeah, because kids need to get their energy out in order to focus. The law does not say when schools should hold the second recess, leaving it up to teachers to decide. Parent Darcy Manfredi is all for it. American schools tend to have you sit and work and work and work, and I think kids generally learn better if they're moving their bodies. It's very scientific. Yeah. <laughs> Monica Garcia, 12 News. All right, Monica, thanks so much. The farm bill signed by President Trump will make hemp and the CBD industry legal. And there's actually a lot of research that CBD helps with seizures and arthritis. Arizona Farm Bureau backed that bill.